Hello everyone and welcome to Simply Learn. I hope you guys are doing great and staying safe. In today's session, we'll be discussing some top DevOps tools that you must know in 2023. Now, in the dynamic world of DevOps, staying abreast of the top tools is essential for professionals seeking to enhance their productivity and efficiency. So, DevOps tools discussed in this tutorial will cover a broad spectrum of functionalities ranging from automation and containerization to monitoring and project management. Familiarity with these tools enables professionals to streamline the development and operations processes, improve collaboration and achieve faster, more reliable software releases and much more. So without any further ado, let's get started with today's topic. Now in a world driven by rapid technological advancements, businesses are constantly seeking ways to deliver software faster and more efficiently. Enter DevOps, the dynamic philosophy that has revolutionized the software development and operations landscape. DevOps is not just a buzzword, it's a game-changing approach that bridges the gap between developers and operations team, foster collaboration and enhancing the entire software development life cycle. Now, at its core, DevOps embodies a cultural shift towards seamless integration and continuous delivery. It promotes a collaborative environment where developers, system administrators, quality assurance professionals and other stakeholders work together harmoniously and promoting cross-functional communication. DevOps empowers teams to streamline processes, automate workflows, and ultimately deliver high-quality software at an accelerated pace. Having said that, the demand for DevOps professionals has overgrown in recent years, as more and more companies adopt DevOps practices to improve their software development and delivery processes. So, are you ready to advance your professional career to the next level? Taking our step-by-step Simply Learn's postgraduate program in DevOps in collaboration with IBM will help you start your DevOps journey that will prepare you for the DevOps engineer role. So in order to match your skills with market demand, this DevOps training program is designed in collaboration with Caltech CTME and our cutting-edge blended learning combines live online DevOps certification classes with interactive labs to give you a practical experience. This DevOps training program will cover skills like DevOps methodology, continuous integration, DevOps on cloud infrastructure, deployment automation, and many more. And along with that, you'll also get hands-on experience with the latest tools and techniques including Terraform, Maven, Ansible, Docker, Jenkins, and much more. So if you're looking to pursue your career as a DevOps engineer and acquire these skills that will prepare you for your job, consider enrolling in this intensive training program today. We will leave the link in the description box below, so make sure you check that out. So let us move ahead and proceed with our topic today. So the main question is what fuels this DevOps revolution? Now, it's a powerful collection of tools specifically designed to support and amplify its principles. So these tools act as a catalyst, empowering teams to automate tasks, manage infrastructure efficiently, and monitor application performance effectively. So without any further delay, let us directly jump into the top nine noteworthy tools highlighting their features, benefits, and significance that have become synonymous with the DevOps ecosystem in no particular order. So first on the list, we have Jenkins. Now, Jenkins is an open source automation server known for its extensive plugin ecosystem, making it highly versatile and customizable. It facilitates continuous integration and continuous delivery, or in short, CACD pipelines, automating the build, test, and deployment processes. Jenkins enables team to integrate code frequently, ensuring early detection of issues and faster software releases. So let us now look at some of the key features of the Jenkins. Firstly, easy installation and configuration. Jenkins has a user-friendly web interface that simplifies installation, configuration, and management of build jobs and pipelines. Distributed build for scalability. Now, it supports for a vast ecosystem of plugins for seamless integration, and it can distribute build tasks across multiple nodes, which helps in parallelizing builds and reducing overall build time, especially in large projects. And finally, extensible through scripting languages like Groovy. Now, Jenkins provides extensibility through scripting languages like Groovy, which is a powerful and versatile language that runs on the Java virtual machines or in short JVM. So by leveraging Groovy scripting capabilities, Jenkins becomes highly adaptable and customizable to meet the specific requirements of different development teams and projects. So those are some of the key features of Jenkins. Let us now move ahead and discuss some of the benefits or advantages of using Jenkins. So firstly, we have enabled faster feedback and quicker time to market. Now, Jenkins continuous integration capabilities enable developers to merge their code changes into a shared repository regularly. By doing so, Jenkins automatically triggers build and testing processes to validate any kind of changes. This automates feedback loop allows developers to receive quick feedback on the quality of their code. So as a result, issues and bugs can be identified early in the development cycle, preventing the accumulation of defects and reducing the time required to fix them. 
As discussed earlier, it also facilitates early issue detection and reduce bug turnaround time. Now, with Jenkins running automated builds and tests every time new code is committed, potential issues and bugs are caught early in the development process. So, by detecting issues at an early stage, developers can address them promptly before they propagate further into the code base. And finally, automates repetitive tasks, same time and effort. Now, Jenkins automates various tasks involved in the software development lifecycle. This includes tasks such as building the code, running tests, and deploying applications. By automating these repetitive and time-consuming tasks, Jenkins saves developers and operations teams significant amount of time and efforts. So that is what Jenkins is all about. It's so widely adopted in the DevOps landscape due to its flexibility and extensive plugin support. And learning it will add a great value to your array of skills. So its ability to automate CI/CD processes and integrate with various tools makes it a crucial component of modern software development and delivery pipelines. Second on the list, we have Docker. Docker has revolutionized application deployment with its containerization approach. It allows developers to package applications and their dependencies into lightweight, isolated containers. Docker contains provide consistency across different environments, ensuring that applications run consistently regardless of the underlying infrastructure. This portability along with the rapid startup times and efficient resource utilization has made Docker a foundational tool in DevOps practices. So let us now some, discuss some of the key features of Docker. First one is packaging applications and dependencies into containers. Now Docker allows developer to package their applications and all their dependencies into a self-contained unit called containers and the process is known as containerization. Now these containers encapsulate the application code, its runtime, various libraries and system tools required to run the application. By doing so, Docker ensures consistency across different environments. Secondly, efficient resource utilization through containerization. Now, this lightweight nature of containers allows for more efficient resource utilization. Multiple containers can run on a single physical machine without the need for individual OS instances. It means that you can host more applications and services on the same hardware, reducing the number of servers needed. And finally, easy scaling and management of containers. Now, containerization simplifies application scaling and management. So when you need to handle increased application load, you can quickly scale by running more instances on the containerized application on additional servers or within a container orchestration platform like Kubernetes. So let us now talk about some of the benefits of the Docker tool. Now, firstly, rapid deployment and scalability. Docker enables rapid deployment of applications to its lightweight and containerized approach. When using Docker, developers package their applications and dependencies into containers which encapsulate everything needed to run the application. So these containers are portable and can be easily moved from one environment to the other. And next we have the isolation of applications and dependencies for improved security. Docker utilizes containerization to isolate applications and their dependencies from the ecosystem and other containers. Each container operates in its own user space, separate from other containers, providing a strong level of isolation. This isolation prevents applications from affecting each other and helps contain potential security breaches within the confines of the container. And finally, simplify development to production workflow. Now, Docker streamlines the development to production workflow by providing consistency between different environments. With Docker, developers can create containers that run the same way in development, testing, and production environments thereby reducing the chances of unexpected issues arising during the deployment. So, Docker has become a cornerstone of modern day of practices. Its ability to streamline application deployment and improve resource utilization has transformed software development and operations, enabling faster and more reliable application delivery. So, that was all about Docker. So, let us now move ahead and discuss the next tool, which is Kubernetes. So, next on the list, we have Kubernetes. Kubernetes is an open source container orchestration platform that automates the deployment, scaling and management of containerized applications. It provides a robust infrastructure for running and coordinating containers across clusters of machine, making it easier to manage large scale deployments. DevOps teams can easily deploy, update and scale applications, facilitating faster and more reliable software delivery while promoting collaboration and consistency across development and operations lifecycle through Kubernetes. So let us look at some of the key features of it. Automatic container deployment and scaling. Now container orchestration platforms like Kubernetes provide automatic container deployment and scaling capabilities. When deploying applications on Kubernetes, you can define the desired state of your application using YAML files on declarative configuration. Kubernetes then take care of this ensuring that specified number of container replicas is running at all times. Service discovery and load balancing. 
Now, Kubernetes enables faster feedback and quicker time to market. In a containerized environment, multiple instances of an application may be running across different containers, making it challenging for clients or other services to know the IP addresses of all the running instances and detecting and keeping tracking of the locations of various services within the container cluster. And Kubernetes, for example, provides a built-in service discovery mechanism. Next, we have self-healing and auto restart of containers. Now, container orchestration platform provides self-healing capabilities to ensure that applications are always available and responsive. If a container fails due to an application crash or any other issues, the orchestration platform detects the failure and automatically restarts the failed container. So let us now move ahead and discuss some of the benefits of using Kubernetes tool. Firstly, it is scalable and highly available application and it provides a seeming <coughs> repeat and provides a seamless scaling of resources based on demand. Next, it has a simplified management of containerization applications across various clusters. And finally, automated deployment and updates reducing manual intervention, which further improves resource utilization and optimization. Overall, Kubernetes has emerged as the industry standard for container orchestration. Its ability to automate application deployment, scaling, and management simplifies the complexities of running containerized applications at scale, making it a crucial tool for DevOps practitioners. Moving ahead, let us discuss our next tool, which is Ansible. Ansible is a powerful automation tool that simplifies configuration management, application deployment, and orchestration. It employs a declarative language to define desired state configuration, making it easy to manage and automate infrastructure tasks. Ansible follows an agentless architecture, allowing it to work efficiently across a wide range of systems and environments. So let us now look at some of its features. Firstly, it's a declarative language for defining infrastructure configuration. And it is also an agentless architecture for easy deployment and management as we discussed earlier. Now, this is done through a playbook driven automation for orchestration where extensive library of modules for a wide range of tasks are employed. So, let us now discuss some of its benefits. So, firstly, it's simplified infrastructure management through automation, which increases the operational efficiency with reduced manual tasks. And its idempotent nature ensures that it has consistently and predictability overall. And finally, it supports a wide range of infrastructure automation use cases and with its agentless architecture, it allows easy integration with various systems and environments. So, in a nutshell, Ansible's simplicity, flexibility and ease of use have made it a popular choice for automating infrastructure and application deployment tasks. Active approach and agentless architecture contribute to efficient and streamlined development workforce. So, moving ahead, the next tool on our list is Git is a distributed version control system that has become a fundamental tool for modern software development practices. It allows developers to track changes, collaborate effectively, and manage code base efficiently. Git's decentralized architecture ensures that developers can work offline and merge changes seamlessly across branches. Let us now discuss with some of its key features. Now, its distributed version control system has efficient collaboration with various uh, tools within the management of the ecosystem of DevOps and it also has an integration with various code hosting platforms which is the branching and merging capabilities for concurrent development. And finally, it support for code reviews and collaboration workflows which also gives a commit based tracking of changes. So these are some of the key features of Git. So let us now discuss some of the advantages or like benefits of using Git. So firstly, it's easy tracking and management of code changes which ensures efficient collaboration and concurrent development within the resource files and its ability to work offline and merge changes seamlessly will benefit a lot of DevOps engineers. And finally, it's easy integration with other DevOps tools makes it a wonderful to use to manage code versions, track changes and enable efficient collaboration which has revolutionized the software development. So it has become an essential tool for version control, facilitating effective collaboration and enabling streamlined DevOps workflows. So moving ahead, the next tool on our list is Terraform. Now Terraform is an infrastructure as code or in short IAC tool that allows teams to define and provision infrastructure resources in a declarative manner. It supports multiple cloud providers and enables consistent and reproducible infrastructure deployment. Terraform's declarative syntax and state management capabilities simplify infrastructure provisioning and configuration. Let us now look at some of its key features. Firstly, it provides multi-cloud support for provisioning resources across different providers. 
Its infrastructure as code approach for consistent and reproducible deployments makes it a declarative syntax for defining infrastructure configurations. And finally, automated resource provisioning and dependency management. So some of its benefits or the advantages of using Terraform is its simplified resource provisioning and dependency management. Now Terraform's infrastructure as code approach supports for multiple cloud providers makes it an essential tool for managing infrastructure codes and collaboration and version control for infrastructure configurations as well. And finally, it's state management for tracking infrastructure changes, which makes it a beneficial tool for DevOps engineers. Now, NIGOS is used to monitor and manage the health and performance of the infrastructure, application, and network resources. It's a comprehensive monitoring solution to identify and resolve issues proactively, ensuring high availability and reliability of systems. So let us look at some of its key features. Firstly, it's monitoring capabilities. Secondly, it's centralized configure management. And finally, it's event handling and escalation tool. So learning Nagios is also crucial and beneficial if you are start, just starting on DevOps journey. So moving ahead, let us now discuss our next tool on our list, which is ELK Stack. Now, ELK Stack offers a comprehensive solution for centralizing logs from various applications and systems, making it easier for DevOps teams to monitor, troubleshoot, and gain valuable insights from their log data. The ELK stack comprising Elasticsearch, Logstatch, and Kibana provides a comprehensive log management and analysis platform. It acts as a distribution search and analytics engine while Logstack collects, processes, and transforms logs. And finally, Kibana offers a user-friendly interface for visualizing and exploring data. So some of its key features including real-time monitoring and alerting, scalable and efficient log storage and retrieval, and distributed search and analytics to data visualization and exploration with Kibana. Let us look at some of its benefits. So firstly, it's real-time monitoring for proactive detect <coughs> repeat. It's real-time log monitoring for proactive issue detection with the help of centralized log management and analysis. Advanced log analytics for troubleshooting and performance optimization, making it a scalable architecture for handling large-scale volumes of data. And finally, efficient log storage and retrieval for compliance and auditing purposes. In a nutshell, ELK stack has gained immense popularity for its ability to handle log management and analysis at scale. It empowers DevOps teams with real-time insights into application and infrastructure logs, facilitating effective troubleshooting and performance optimization. Well, finally on the list, we have Jira software. Jira is a widely used project management tool that supports agile development methodologies. It offers robust features for planning, tracking and managing tasks, issues and workflows. Jira's customizable boards, backlogs and workflows empower teams to collaborate effectively, visualize and progress to gain transparency into project statuses. With integration to various DevOps tools, Jira facilitates seamless tracking of development activities, enabling continuous improvement and efficient project management. Some of its key features are customizable boards, workflows for project management, agile planning and estimation features, issue tracking and management capabilities. And some of its benefits include efficient task management and tracking, enhanced collaboration and visibility across various teams, and integration with various DevOps tools for streamlined workflows. It also helps in reporting and analytics for project insights and performance measurement. Finally, Jira has become a go-to tool for agile project management in the DevOps ecosystem. Its ability to support agile methodologies, track tasks and integrate with other DevOps tools makes it a valuable asset for teams seeking efficient project management and continuous improvement. So learning it will add a great value to your area of skills again. So these were some of the top nine DevOps tools that you must know, which will help you enhance and accelerate your career in DevOps. In conclusion, as the DevOps landscape evolves, these tools will continue to play a pivotal role in driving innovation and empowering organizations to deliver high quality software products efficient. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.